Hello everyone. My name is Silvia. Welcome to your Mindful Monday session of today. Uh, this is the first time you're seeing me here. Uh, I am not Belinda, but I work with Belinda and I am a vitality coach in mental health and well-being. So I'm going to be guiding you through now our next few Mindful Monday sessions. Hopefully you're going to enjoy them. Uh, I have planned for today a bit of a light movement mindfulness session. So this is going to be beneficial for all of us to sort of bring awareness into our bodies, notice how we're feeling and notice any sensations. Perhaps this can help us relieve stress as well, as well which is something that we can all experience. So hopefully that will be beneficial. Uh, I hope you will find it useful and uh, I'm going to get started. So mindfulness and any sort of mindful activity that we do is based on trying to be present in the here and now. So what I would like you to do is notice how you're feeling and find any position, any um, place where you're going to feel comfortable. For this, you can be sitting, you can be laying down, you can um, be in a comfortable position in either of those, but not standing. Your body's weight will need to be held by either a chair, a sofa or the floor, wherever you feel more comfortable. So find where that is, find the position and the posture in which you want to be uh, for this session. And when you have found that posture, just notice where you have chosen to be. If you, are cho if you have chosen to sit in a chair that is familiar and comfortable to you, notice what you notice about it. Spend a few seconds sort of getting in touch with where you're at. And if you're on the floor, you don't need to look at me. You can just listen to my voice and I'm going to guide you through the next uh, few minutes of our mindful light movement session. If you're on the floor, just notice um, where you're at, the texture, the place where you're at, uh, and explore which position your body wants to be in. When you have found that place and made a bit of a connection with that place, I would like to invite you to take three deep breaths. And I'm going to ask you to do that on your own rhythm at your own pace. Three deep breaths that I'm going to take as well. giving a bit more time to those of you that are taking a bit longer. And to those of you who've done your three breaths, take one more, the deepest breath you've taken today. <clears throat> and just notice how your breathing is. Now I'm gonna ask you wherever you are to bring awareness into your hands. Bring awareness into your hands by either just noticing them or looking at them. Wiggle your fingers and look at them. Notice what you notice, whether that is the lines in your skin, the color of them, the texture, your fingernails. Notice what is visible to the eye, but also notice the temperature. Notice any sensations in your skin. Notice how it feels when you move your hands against each other and the different movements you can do with them. Spend a few seconds doing that. And now start moving your hands as if you were manipulating a pizza dough. Like you are trying to get all those ingredients together. And stay with the movement of opening and closing your hands. Open and close them and play with the strength you put on these. Play with the speed you do this with. Doing it very slowly. 
or faster. Play with how, what parts of your hands are involved. You can do it with the tip of your fingers mainly, the tips of your fingers. With the whole finger, notice if you can engage your thumb in that movement. Notice if you can engage your whole wrist too. Is there a way you can make the movement bigger? Bring awareness into the palm of your hands and slow down that movement so that you can look at the palm of your hands in between, in between each opening and closing of them. Then looking at your hands, with them, start giving this kind of movement that we've been doing to your opposite wrist. As if you're giving yourself a gentle massage. You're giving your opposite wrist a gentle massage. You can take turns to do it with one hand to the other wrist. Start gently. To a gentle movement, as if you're just waking up your skin, noticing its temperature, noticing its texture. Decide if you want to focus on one wrist so that you can bring more attention to it. Stay with that wrist if that feels more comfortable and then move to the other when you feel ready. Or notice if you need a more active movement, activating both wrists at the same time. And how can you do that? How can you negotiate that? Continue this journey through your arms. Feel the skin. Feel the more meaty part of your arm. That's how I call it anyways. And feel your bones. Can you feel the parts of your arms that are harder, more bony? Can you feel those parts that are softer? Continue this journey through your arms till you get to the shoulders. Keep massaging either lightly or playing with the strength awakening the contact of your arms with your hands. Continue the journey to your shoulders and spend some time massaging and bringing awareness into your shoulders. Go into all the shoulder and explore again with your fingers, with the palm of your hands, even with the back part of your hands, how it feels. Apply different types of pressure. Continue the journey and go into the neck and the back of the head. We usually have tension in this part of our bodies. So just notice how this part of your body feels. Keep doing this sort of massaging movement like you were doing with the pizza, but in the back of your head. You just need to be a lot more delicate than if this was an object. This is your body. Move your fingers into the surface and the back of your head. Do a little movement, a little movement, continuing with the massaging. Go into the surface of your head and do a movement like, like raindrops, like raindrop movement on your head like you're tapping 
and exploring how it feels all over your head. Move to one side and the other and all around your head, giving it a light massage. Feel the texture of your head. Move your fingers around it. Give your head a massage. Notice what you notice. Spend a few more seconds on your head or as long as you need to. When you're ready, move into your face. If you're not ready yet, spend longer in your head and move later when you're ready. Move into your face and notice the lines, the structure. Gently travel around your face. Gently play with the pressure that you apply on your temples. Not to notice if there's any tension around your forehead by applying a bit more pressure uh, and around the third eye, what we call the third eye, that helps us with awareness. Apply some pressure. Never apply more pressure than you can bear. Just keep it light, awakening your face. Massage around your eyes. Does it feel cold? Does it feel warm? Warm your hands if you need to. Notice what you notice. Continue to your nose. Feel the different textures around your nose. <clears throat> Notice the, the bones, the skin, the parts that you can move, the bone that holds it. And then continue to your mouth. Use your hands to connect with your mouth. Use your hands to connect with your cheeks. Use your hands to connect with your lips. Tap on your mouth. Apply some light touch. <clears throat> Check your jaw. Massage around it. Notice how it feels. From there, go back to the back of your head, passing through your ears and noticing them. Go back to the back of your head, your neck. Spend the next few moments in paying attention to whatever part of all of those that you've massaged or touched you are more drawn to now. Go back to that part of the body. Give it a bit more attention. <clears throat> Notice what your body is telling you. Focus your attention in that journey we have done from the hands to the arms, shoulders, neck, back of the head, top of the head, face. Spend the next few moments in that part that you have noticed or that you are drawn to or that feels 
slightly tense or that feels comfortable. And give yourself permission to spend the next few seconds in massaging, touching and sensing that part of your face or your neck or your arms, that part of your body. Notice what, how you want to leave that part of the body after, after you've made contact with it and brought attention to it. When you're ready, come back to your hands and have a bit of a squeeze between them, applying pressure to bring the awareness back into your hands, almost like you're giving a handshake to yourself. Move it around from one hand to the other. Apply more pressure, open your fingers, close them, apply less pressure, play with it. And when you're ready, let go of the hands. Let go of the movement and come back to your breathing. In your own time, take three deep breaths. After you've done your three breaths, take a moment to come back to where you're at. If you have your eyes closed, start getting ready to open them. If you have your eyes open, notice what you see, where you're sitting or you're laying down. Awaken again those parts of your body that we didn't focus on today. and come back to the present moment. Notice what you notice. Notice, notice any feelings, any thoughts or any sensations. Has anything changed in your body? Has any, anything changed in your mind, in your posture? Notice if you need to move in a certain way. Give it a few more seconds to notice how you're noticing. And when you're ready, bring this to an end. Thank you for joining me in this mindful light movement. We have focused today in the top part of our body, doing a light massage and a light awakening of certain parts of our body and processing how it feels and how the sensations in our body are when we put two of them in contact with each other. If you found this helpful to manage your stress or to bring more awareness into your body, Please, please make sure to press like and subscribe to your uh, Vitality YouTube channel to make sure that you don't miss our next session. I'll be with you soon and hope to see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye-bye.